This is going to be a short demonstration on how to install a 2.5 inch laptop IDE drive into a USB external enclosure. By using two of the most common adapters. There's one. The other. First what you need to do for the external enclosure is find the IDE cable. This is the IDE cable. Most importantly on the side of the IDE cable it's marked in red. That's pin one. With either one of these laptop adapters, they're clearly marked to show pin one. It's either with a one or a diamond on top. What you want to do is press that in place, lining up the red cable and pin one, then putting together the power supply. Now you take the laptop ID drive and as you flip it over you see a row of pins, a gap, and then two more. These are the jumper settings on the, on the ID drive. You want to place that and make a gap between pin one and the jumper settings. So you would see a gap as in so here. This shows that it's lined up correctly. And you just plug in your USB cable, power on your drive. Showing the other adapter. This adapter here is clearly marked with a 1. Again, you want to line that up on the ID cable inside the tray, which is marked clearly by red. Press it in firm position. Have that lined up. Again, you want to take and attach the power supply. The power supply is fixed, so it can only go in one way. Don't force it. It gently goes in. Box in place. Again, on the IE drive, there's a gap between the jumper settings, four pins, and then a row of pins. This would be pin one. Again, I fix the pin one here. Presses in. And again, you can see a small gap between the jumper settings and the rest of the pins. Again, plug in your cable, power it on.